Good morning, my peoples. Last night on my last video, I told y'all that I was going to talk about the GoHawk, the Universal Motorcycle um, Radio. All right, I have the new one, the one with the LED light on it. Now, I hear a lot of people talk about they cannot hear it because of the factor of they said it's not loud enough. All right, so I got it um, last month, and I had it for a while. Um, I took it on. I took it on a road trip. Had it for when I went to uh, up to PA around Gettysburg. You know, I have a friend that likes going up there, so we always take a motorcycle trip up there for his birthday. So to make a long story short, the radio. I hear other people talking about it, about how the radio. You know, you can't get the sound out of. It. Well, some people say because of the wind. It's true. If you don't have a wind deflector. It's going to the wind is going to drown the music out. If you're going at a let's say a high rate of speed, the wind is going to and the motor and your muffler is going to drown the sound out. I have a NC I have an NC 700X, a Honda NC 700X, which is nothing but a sports enduro. I don't have a huge windshield, but the thing is, driving the back roads from Maryland to PA around 45 miles an hour, even up to 50, I heard the radio fine. You're not gonna hear it if you got loud pipes or if you're going at a high rate of speed. The wind drowns it out. I use my, I have a full face helmet. When I close my full face helmet and the wind is going around, I can hear that thing through my helmet with everything closed, the windshield closed and everything. So I'm, I'm good with um, the sound of it. No, I mean, yeah, you can buy ones that's louder. But for the use of where that one can fit in, it does pretty good. I listened to it the whole way from Merlin all the way up to Gettysburg and back. So, um, so it's, it's a thing of, yeah, if you're going over 55, 65 miles an hour, anywhere up to 70 it's a good thing the wind is going to just drown it out if you don't have a windshield and block the wind the wind is just going to get in your ear and drown it out but for everyday use just piddling around town cruising around town that thing is loud it, it is loud so i say it's, it's it ain't bad it's not it's not a bad purchase you know to throw on your bike to go don't get me wrong, like I said, I've seen some other universals out there that could be louder, but I'm limited on space on my bike in between my handlebars, so it fits for what I need. So I hope that helps people make a decision if you decide you want to get it or not. Alrighty, catch y'all later.